caught on camera a woman seen vandalizing political signs at a Davy home. And she notices she's being filmed and, well, flips off the camera. And now police are getting involved in this one. Local tennis Andrew Perez is live with the details. Andrew, not the first time we hear about these things that people need to kind of tone it down a little bit. Yeah, not the second, not the third, not the fourth. I think you get the point here. The point is that this is not a story about political races or political affiliations. This family saying, bottom line, if it's not yours, don't touch it. She knew we had cameras because the light turned on and she saw the middle finger. That's why she saw the middle finger. It seems the cameras were a challenge because first she drove by flipping the bird right at him comes back a second time to remove a political sign in the front yard of the Ortiz family home in Davie. The sign supporting Governor Ron DeSantis. You should have respect. So if you're a Republican or Democrat, you should have respect for each other. I would never do that personally. You know. I told my family I'm going to report it. Lelise Ortiz made it official and filed a police report in Davie just to have it on record. Unfortunately, we see this happen every political season from Trump signs defaced in Miami to Biden signs stolen in Fort Lauderdale. It makes me feel very sad that things have come to this. Why does this offend somebody so much on a private property? With sign snatchers and vandals repeatedly caught on camera, it's a reminder to take a breather. Police can and will charge for trespassing and vandalism. So again, Davy police, they are looking into this case. You can imagine how many cases don't even go reported. Charges are possible here. That's the latest in Davy. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.